Hello, somebody home. Who is at my door? Oh, oh, oh. look at oh, <laughs> this guy. Hello. Uh, what are you How want? you doing? So, may I come in? Depends. Are you going to try to push your NHL propaganda against me? No. No, huh? You're moving awful propaganda slow there. I'm, 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 I'm watching you. No. Propaganda, you're saying, you know, here, take a fish. Oh, take man. Take a chill fish. It's all good. Is the this NHL, uh, naturally harvested? It is organic. Um, we got these fish from drowns, actually hand catching them and bringing them mm. to me. So this is organic fish. Don't you worry. Mm, okay. The NHL, there is no flukes and flaws. You know, I saw you plastering, um, you know, my place over there with signs. I'm totally, you know, I'm cool with free speech. The NHO has a good spirit, a good heart. We are a charity. Even, you know, we accept free speech from people like you who are obviously, <laughs> mm. I don't even have to say that, obviously against charitable foundations and, mm. you know, hating nature. Ah, yes. So do your free speech, do whatever you want. But this was vandalism. And I will report this to Zizuma Void. And there might be a, port, uh, a court case for that. So you better lawyer up. Oh, it's, it's, let's just put it this way NHO is bad they are oh god i can't even put it into words you are you're like the company that is terrible and then tries to play it off like you're good and no ugh, I, oh god you're terrible just no you know what just get out of my house i'll see you in court see you're running out of arguments but you know i We'll keep part of these as evidence, but you can some have some of your trash bag. Oh, okay. And if I ever see you vandalizing my place again, we might have to talk, right? We really might have to talk. And yeah. then I might not come alone. Time and Just place, saying. my friend. Time and place. Just saying. I might not come alone. Just saying. Yeah. Yeah. All right. See you later, man. Likewise. Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode on the Hermitcraft Season 6 server. I hope you guys are all doing good. I'm doing fantastic. Today's episode 18, and I've got a great episode planned for you. We start today's episode off playing ketchup. And not the delicious kind that goes on food, but the kind that when you're in the end and you lose all your items and you rage quit type. <laughs> Anyways guys, question of the day for today. With me dying in the end, it made me think, what is your all-time worst death in Minecraft? Let me know down in the comment section below using hashtag question of the day. As always, if you guys enjoy this series, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe. Turn on notifications for when the videos come out. Otherwise, guys, let's get into the video. All right, guys, so to start today's episode off, I want to tell you a story of woe. Where I was in the end, I was going there because I wanted to get a few elytra for something that I was going to be doing in the episode today. I also agreed to help Grian get another one because he died and lost all of his items. So with that being said, I'm in the end city and I'm doing good. I've found like four or five Elytra and I lost the shocker box, the shocker box that had the Elytras in them. So here's where it gets worse. I think it's in an end city and I think I know where it's at. But the problem is, is that I died going back there i was looking at the web page for how do you find in cities on minecraft and i flew into a, a, a course fruit and died so tango was kind enough to sell me two elytras one to give to green because he did pay me for it so i owe him for that and then for me so i can go back to the end today and get my stuff back and i, I think i know where it's at so with that being said i have a quick clip that i need to show you of me and Tango, we did a small little rec recording for this. So watch that, and I'll be back in just a second. Look at this. Look at this. Shop isn't even open yet. And hey, the, the customers hey. are banging down the door. <laughs> I need these Elytra, okay? It's, it's serious business. I need them, man. No, I, really. <laughs> I'm over here scratching my neck for Elytra. 
Oh no! <laughs> I need it, All man. Right. I need it. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, man. I'll do whatever you need. <laughs> so you right. said that uh, I was gonna get some early bird pricing, huh? What's, what's... uh huh? Early bird pricing, twenty diamonds. Oh, awesome, awesome. So I'm how's gonna need sound? another one for, from you. Too. You're gonna need two. I'm gonna need we can two. do two. Oh, okay. How's that? And then, uh, how much are you gonna sell me some gunpowder for? Uh, let's. I got. Oh, I got a couple stacks of rockets. I can give you or gunpowder. Either one is fine. Or gu I don't have the gunpowder on me. That's back at the shop. If you know what I'm saying. Yeah, but that... I got like I got like three or four shulkers full of it there. Yeah, I'll, but I'll, I'll, I'll take just gonna the make rockets. rockets so. Yeah, that that works. Okay. All right. So... I'll I'll give you two stacks of rockets here. It's unfortunately all I got without going all right, back. Cool. So, here. How about this? Right. I told uh -huh. you that since it's early, early on. I told you I would tip you nicely. Okay. But bam. Just right there. Just take it, man. What's this go? Just what? A, a full stack of diamonds. It's yours. No you cray cray, man. Asked. A whole stack? Are you serious? It, it's, 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 you're helping me out, man. I, I died. <laughs> uh, so everybody's going to already know, but I died in the end, and oh, I no. lost like five five elytras. So oh, I, that's the worst. Why I mean, weren't you putting... Oh, come on. Man. I don't. I the don't. Lecture, you put them in your ender chest well, as you're going. That's what I, I don't have silk touch, right? And so I was like oh, hoping that I would run have... into oh, come here, come uh, here. an ender chest come that here. had like, you know, you know how they have ender chests here. in the end cities? Here. And I, I mean, like, yeah, I yeah, could, yeah, yeah, yeah. but they didn't have them. They like they were all popped. And so oh. by the time I got there, you know, <laughs> well, I didn't. That might have been me. <laughs> <laughs> I don't. I don't. Well, I did. I. I was. I managed to find some, but it was like like four thousand blocks away. Oof. So I'm just hoping well, that my stuff is still there. So yeah, hopefully. Good luck yeah. with that. Well, thank you, and thank you so right. much for letting hey, me buy this. That, anytime, all your elytra and flight needs. You hear, that, flight. you hear that server? Everybody, buy, <laughs> I will. I will probably buy every bit of rockets that you have. I don't Sounds know. good. I will so. have many in, in store tonight. Awesome. All right, dude. Thanks thank a lot. You. Thanks. All right, guys. So I am back. I hope you guys enjoyed that little quick clip with Tango, and I really appreciate it. I I tipped him very generously for two elytras. I gave him like twenty four diamonds. Um, so with that being said, now I've, I have like already started grinding to get my, uh, armor and stuff back. You're going to notice that I have 51 levels. The 51 levels are from the guardian farm. So I've already got, I'm um, breaking, mending and protection that needs to go on pretty much all of these. Um, that one already has protection. And then I've got an elytra and I'm going to grab an unbreaking book and a mending book. And we're going to put these on here real fast. And naturally, that would break while I'm standing here. Boy, I tell you what, and when it comes to anvils, your boy's got about the worst luck on the planet. <laughs> it is not good, man. Let me go ahead and quickly make another anvil real fast. Yeah, fix all my all my duties here because we um, are going to be going to the end in just a second. Now, like I said, I know exactly where I need to go to to hopefully find the shocker boxes. I can live without finding my items because I didn't have very much on me. Uh, I actually left with pretty much all of my tools at home. That's what these are here for. So we have mending. We have unbreaking on our elytra. Not to mention I have a decent amount of gunpowder. So there was nobody on the server, right? And I decided to test my uh, my farm. I, was at, I actually got about 30 gunpowder in about seven minutes. Pretty quick, right? So we've got plenty of rockets. There we go. And uh, so, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and go to the end and hope for the best. So I'm not going to record all of it, but if I do find my stuff, I will record it. G heckin G. That's right, people. I found it. Oh, my God. So here's remember the story, right? I was I was flying and I came down here. And I thought I picked it up. It was literally laying right there. I walk down and see it. And I run up and pick it up. And oh my god, Elytra. So there are some other shocker boxes out there that I did have on me. But they were with my death. Now, I haven't found my death yet. But all they really had was like diamond armor. So I did find some other diamond armor though. Wow, that's a really good boots. We won't even have to make boots. That's good boots too. Holy crap, good armor. So I found what I was looking for. So right now... Our coordinates are negative 4,600, negative 32, or positive 3,200. If I fly out of here and come back in the positive direction, you see all these bridges? I actually bridged just about 4,600 blocks. Uh, not totally. I mean, I took pathways. But as I was flying back, 
Uh, to go back, I, I'm not sure in which direction I was going, but as I was flying, I hit a chorus fruit. Now, I was all over this area and couldn't find my items, so I'm assuming that they despawned, but if they didn't, then we may be able to find them, but I would, uh, I'm not sure if it was farther down or not. Um, doesn't look, oh, I say, it doesn't look like I came to this island, but maybe I did. Let's still just take a quick look, because you never know. The only thing that I had on me that was really of any importance whatsoever... Um, well, there's light over here. Why is there light over here? Ooh. Oh, that's an end city. Okay, that's good that that's there then, because I can get back from there. Uh, the only thing that was of any importance was my armor. I didn't bring any of my tools because I knew if I died I would lose them. So... Yeah, I, I think my stuff is probably gone. So not that big of a loss. We lost one Elytra. That was the one that I was flying with, and it was nearly broken. So, yeah, I'm not seeing it. But at this point, I've got plenty of Elytra durability. I could probably just keep doing a little bit more exploring. Huh. Yeah, I don't see my items. It's a shame. Yeah, I, I just... um. I think from now on, when I explore in the end, I should probably be recording and just keep F3 like permanently on. Anyways, guys, let's go ahead and I'm going to meet you back at the base. I will show you any new stuff that I've gotten. Um, but yeah, I'll meet you there. OK, guys, we are finally back home. I found a lot of stuff, so we have quite a few more gems. We have uh, replenished our shocker shells. I have a little bit more diamonds. I, I gave Tango a stack because I felt like that was fair. Uh, so let's go up here and look at the real goods here. So one of these is green. So I have five extra elytra plus the one I'm wearing. Uh, I found these two pickaxes. One is a mending efficiency pickaxe. The other is a sharpness, fire aspect, curse of vanishing, unbreaking. I found two chest plates, protection, protection. Uh, both of the boots are the same. And then protection, unbreaking, protection, unbreaking. So it's kind of funny because I was actually going to make new armor, but now that I think about it, I don't think I'm going to need to do that anymore. I have all these extra tools and stuff, so I'm going to sort through those. But uh, the thing is, is that what the reason why I went to the end in the first place was is because our shop is getting a little stale. We haven't had, you know, very many sales lately. And so what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to make two very special uh, treasure boxes that uh, are going to be 30 diamonds a piece. Now, these dime or these are going to be made out of shocker boxes. So that's uh, instant treasure. And they are going to feature some <clears throat> very, <clears throat> very, very rare uh, loot, if you know what I'm saying. So before we do that, though, before we get to that point, I want to go ahead and look through our armor. So let's go ahead and take a look at what we have right now. So this is already finished. This one's not ours, so we'll get rid of that. This doesn't need to be in my inventory anymore. Put that up here. There we go. OK, so first things first, we know that we're good there. So we need a helmet. Now, none of the helmets actually have what we need. So let's go downstairs and combine these. Tech flight is officially open. Awesome. I'll definitely be using his shop. That costs 10 levels for that one. But this is only protection three. So I'm not too worried about that. So let's put that there. So I'm going to keep that on me because I can add to that. Uh, then we have boots, which are already pretty much finished. We need to get feather falling. The chest plates are already finished. The only thing we really need is leggings, and we didn't really get any, any enchanted leggings. So we can go ahead and uh, pretty much re replace all of our armor. So this needs protection three, which is uh, right protection four. That also needs mending. There we go. So the helmet will be finished. So protection four. Mending. I might put respiration and stuff on that, but this year I'm or this season, I'm more interested in just having a good set of armor. Give me two seconds. I am recording. There we go. Uh, so next up, I have so that's finished. 
chest plates finished. Let's take a look at the boots. The boots are pretty much good to go besides feather falling. So all we really need is protection four, unbreaking three, and mending. There we go. Mending, unbreaking three, protection four. So we have a very good set of armor now that we can use on and off with the elytra. So now we can decide what to do with the rest of this stuff, which will most likely go in the shocker shells. So pretty good. So I'm going to see what Doc wants. I'll be back. All right, guys. So I did what I said I was going to do. And I went and dropped off Green's elytra in his bottle. And I made two very, very, very lucrative um, treasure maps. These are treasure maps one and two. Now, these are going to cost. Um, I can't decide if I want to do. Let's see our, our shockers or our. Our things now are 10 a piece. I can't decide if I want to do 30 or 20. I don't know if 20 is really fair. Maybe 25? I don't know. Hmm. That is a tough de decision. There are zombies everywhere. Okay. Anyways, let's go over here. Probably gonna have to kill these guys real fast. I also stopped by the Guardian farm again to grab some more XP. We need to, oh, scared the crap out of me, holy crap. Uh, we need to enchant uh, our two. Okay, sure, whatever you say. So welcome to iJevin's booty. 10 diamonds, you can purchase a custom treasure map. Uh, let's go ahead and make some new signs here. Uh, where do I want to put it? Uh, let's do right here. New, epic, well, let's do caps, epic. Treasure maps. Treasure maps. I can't decide on how many diamonds. Oh, come on. So many zombies. I can't do stuff. Uh, there we go. Let's try this again. I think I'm going to make it 25 diamonds. I feel like that's fair because it's very, very good. New. Epic. Treasure. Okay, treasure maps, 25 diamonds. There we go. And I'm going to have to, hmm, how do I want to do this? Because these are the normal treasure maps, right? I'm, you know what? I may actually have to rename these. You can rename treasure maps, right? That's the thing. I'm going to do it like this, right? Put that like right there, maybe something like that. I think I need to make I think I'm going to have to name a sign or a piece of paper or something. Um, I don't I doubt there's an anvil around here anywhere. Um, let's run back to the base real fast because I didn't think about that. I'm sorry, guys. I do apologize. We need to name. I think I'll name a piece of paper and I'll put top bottom row. Bottom row, 10 diamonds. Top row, 25 diamonds. So let's grab some paper. Okay. Actually, I don't have to name two pieces of paper. There we go. Put that right there. 25 diamonds. Oh my god. All right, your boys is running out of anvils left and right. I may still have the one outside. Let me look real fast. Nope. Gotta make another one. I am just, I'm using all the anvils today, man. Okay. There we go. So another anvil. I, you think I would learn to, there we go. All right, cool. Got what we need there. Let's head back over to the shop district now and we will fix that. I'm about to just fly. I think I'm going to need to ask Python to light up his house a little bit better. He has mobs spawning all over the top of that thing. Okay. So 10 diamonds for the bottom row. 25 diamonds. I don't know. I think I'm going to have to do it like this. There we go. So something like that right there. That should take care of that. So 25 diamonds, 10 diamonds. 
So iJevin Booty now has new maps available. They are very, very lucrative and worth your money. And you will get very, very good treasure. So give me your diamonds. Oh, don't blow up. Yeah. Nope, going this way. All right, so I, like I said, I went over to the Guardian farm and got some more XP because I want to enchant the rest of our tools. So let's do that now. That was sketchy. We may need to light that up over there. So um, I'm going to enchant these two. I'm going to enchant first, but we'll see how that goes. Oh, thank God, dude. All right, not bad. We actually got some decent enchants that time. I'm proud of myself. So this one needs unbreaking. So unbreaking three for this guy. Put that on there. So unbreaking three, efficiency four. Unbreaking three, efficiency four. Mending. There we go. So throw those on there. So we're doing, doing pretty good for the tools. So let's go ahead and take a look at our set of tools because I know you guys are going to ask. So we have sharpness three, looting three, mending. Uh, that could use some work. Do I have another unbreaking? Go ahead and throw that on here. There we go. This is, uh, oh, I think my other pickaxe is upstairs. Is it this one? Yeah, that one I don't want. There we go. So our pickaxe is efficiency five, mending, uh, forging. All right, good deal, good deal. All right, guys, so next up, I actually want to make sort of a small cactus farm. Uh, I wanna start doing more farms because typically I just rely off other people on the server uh, for certain things. And I don't know, I just, I feel like I wanna start doing more. <laughs> so that's what we're gonna do right now, actually. I'm going to, I'm gonna test this and we're gonna see how this is gonna work. I'm not, 100% certain that I'm completely sold on this yet, how it's going to work. So let's grab some sand. I actually just want to make a very small one. I don't need a lot of cactus, but it would be nice to have a supply of it in the future if I decide to do any kind of dying of any sort. And yeah, plus I wanted to show you the sugarcane farm. So I did some changes. Oh, that's what I meant to do. Crap. We may go upstairs. I don't know if I have enough iron. I want to actually switch the floor out so it can all hoppers eventually. Um... But I added uh, um, the single row of glass. I think it looks really cool. I like it a lot, actually. I don't think I would have enough hoppers for that. I would need quite a lot of iron. You know what? Let's go ahead and try it, because I, I really do want to get rid of the water. I'm not a big fan of it. I, just, I, I like it, but at the same time, like I feel like just a floor of hoppers would be so much better. <clears throat> Excuse me. I apologize. There we go. Okay, so we do have quite a bit of iron, and while that is cooking, let's actually put this one here. So you see that lever being there, but now that we've got the button, feeling classy, boys. There we go. So get that started. And grab you, you. Let's try three. Like I said, I'm not sure how much this is going to take. Is it this one? I like using this little crafting thing. This thing is pretty cool, actually. All right, so I've got over a stack of chests. That might be enough, actually. That's not a, that big of an area. There's 43. You know what? That might be enough. I don't know. Let's go see. Uh, okay, I've got blocks so I can get rid of the water. Yeah, I'm just going to put it pretty much right in the middle. Except for, uh, it'll be up like in, in the air, so. Alright, let's get rid of the water. Water, you got to go, baby. There we go. And then let's get rid of the floor. Hmm. That'll be pretty easy. To, I think this is going to be enough. We'll see, though. Of all this. Yeah, that water was annoying. Didn't like it. Was not a fan. So what I'll do is I'll just honestly, I'll just keep it simple. I was going to like 
run everything off the other ones, but I think it'll be easier just to do this. Hopefully it's not that laggy was the only problem that I'm, I would see with this. There we go. There we go. Fantastic. Yeah, I like that much better. So to test that, I don't see this being a huge issue. That's still going to be a problem. I hate that, man. All right, cool. Now let's go up. I don't see. Hmm, trying to decide how far I want to go up. That sand's gone if I remove it. Oh, no, we have breakage. There we go. All right, so I think I'm going to go up maybe two blocks. So this is the center. Just like that, I think. Okay, put that there. There we go. I may have forgotten a block. I think I can. You know what? I think we'll be okay. Never mind. Put that there. Put that there. There we go. Now. I just hope that the sugar cane doesn't get pushed into it. I don't remember it ever falling more than two blocks, though. So we'll see. Let's go upstairs real fast. Wow, that was a fail. <laughs> you guys didn't see that. There we go. So cactus, cactus. Make a block off the side of this. Need some food real fast. Okay. So we don't want to make this thing grow super huge. So what I'm thinking is... Um... I wonder if I'll be able to get this in there. There we go. Something like that, probably. I literally just want want it to be like one piece. Although I do see the cactus destroying itself on itself. That could be a problem. Anyways, I think that'll take care of everything. So let's um, let's hope that that's going to work. Let's go downstairs real fast and grab all those blocks. Oh, we did have a piece of cactus in there. Anything over here? There we go. So. Looks like upstairs is about ready to burst. Come on. Oh, I'm messing up. I wanted to go down to like the third level. Like, I guess that's not. Oh, never mind. So let's try like, oh, there's. Yeah. This thing needs fixed. It's just not working that well see there's like sugarcane like i wonder how much sugarcane is i guess that can't be more than a few pieces right all right let's give it a test here uh yeah i mean it seems like it's okay i think we're fine i think it's gonna work just fine oh i'm dead oh maybe not actually I forgot that I had uh, boots on again. <laughs> yeah, I think we're going to be OK, guys. If you have any suggestions to maybe improve it, let me know down in the comments. But guys, I think that's probably going to do it for this episode. If you guys enjoyed the video and you want to see more, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe. Turn on notifications when the videos come out. This is iJevin. Peace out.